This video is going to be about how to optimize your CPU like a pro and how to get maximum performance out of your CPU for gaming in 2024 with your any low-end PC in any game. So guys, welcome to my channel. If it's your first time here, please subscribe, drop a like on this video and make sure to follow this complete video. And with this thing in time, let's dive straight into our this video. So go for your Windows search, search for performance and you will find out adjust the appearance and performance settings of your Windows. Now go for advanced tab and there you will find out your processor scheduling, simply set it on program. After that here you will find out this virtual memory. So click on the change button after that here you will find our virtual memory now you need to go for this automatically manage paging size for all drives simply uncheck this box from here therefore we can enable the settings now go for this custom size option and guys enable the settings now here we got our initial size in mb and maximum size in mb now you need to guys use settings very carefully now first of all open up calculator on your computer and now you need to use here these number according to your ram if you are using 8 gb of the ram so guys simply type here 8 and then multiply it 1024 for getting your 8 gb of the ram in mb after that now again click on the multiply button and now type here 1.5 this is 1.5 times more than your ram size and hit ok now simply take this value and simply type here in the initial size so that is 12 to 8, 8. after that now go for maximum size in mb and now you need to multiply this value with 2 and press ok after that you will find that this value now simply type here 2 4 5 7 6 after that now click on the set button and guys enable the settings now click ok click ok again hit apply click ok and close out the settings now in the next step we are going to disable the high position event timer on our pc that will cause a huge impact on our cpu performance so guys for that go for your window search again and search for device and you will find our device manager on your windows open up a device manager and scroll down until you find out the system device option now click on the drop down and there you will find out high precision event timer now right click here and guys make sure to disable this device on your windows 10 or 11 whatever you're using and this will help you to getting the maximum performance out of your cpu so guys now the next step we are going to disable the power throttling on our windows so for the press windows are together from your keyboard and type here gpedit.msc now go for computer configuration administrative test template now go for system now scroll down and find out here power management now go inside it there you will find our power throttling settings so go for this folder and guys there you will find our turn of power throttling now double tap and open up the settings now you need to enable the setting for turning off the power throttling on your windows after that hit apply and click ok and close out local group policy editor now in the next step you need to download this windows optimization pack on your pc link available down in the description you can download from my official website and also from my discord so once you download these files on your pc here you will find out this kind of the rar file and inside you will find out windows debloat and disable unnecessary service now you just simply drag these folders on your desktop now here you will find out these two folders like disable unnecessary app and windows debloat folder now here in the very first step go for disable unnecessary dot bad file right click here and make sure to run this as administrator for having the full access after that here you will find out this kind of interface like batch script created by ripex i am not responsible for damage issue causing by the file or guide you need to simply type here yes and press enter after that here it will ask you for basic disabler standard or advanced you can use any of these and if you want to get more info about it you can simply search for the basic info and you will find out all the info about this application so i will go with basic tweaks so simply type here basic and press enter and thank you for using the optimization and this will automatically close this tool on your pc now in the next step here you will find out ultimate windows tweaker for your windows 10 or 11 you can use it according to your operating system like whatever you are using i'm using right now windows 11 so i will go with the windows 11 folder and inside here is our ultimate windows tweaker 5.1 exe file so guys simply double tap here and open up this application so once you open up this tool you will get this kind of the interface and here you will find out all the information about your system operating system now the very first step go for this performance option and you need to follow the same exact settings also on your pc so guys now here you will find out here the settings that is disable edge step reloading so make sure to check mark on the spokes after that now go on the right side and check mark on disable prefetch service disable superfetch service disable window security and center services disable tablet input service and disable windows time service 
After that, also disable disable printer spoiling service and disable Microsoft Edge preview loading. After that, now go for security and privacy settings. Here you will find out all the security settings of your computer. You can guys simply use it according to your need, but I suggest you simply leave all the security settings. Now go for privacy settings, and this is important settings you need to disable into this application. So guys, check mark on disable telemetry, disable biometric, disable and reset advertisement ID, disable handwriting data sharing, disable taskbar being web search, disable Wi-Fi sense, disable app access to location and disable camera message and account info everything on your PC. Once you follow the same exact settings also on your PC, now let's go for the next step and open up additional settings for your this application. Now again you need to follow the same exact settings also on your PC into the Windows Ultimate Tweaker. After that click on the apply button and apply all these changes on your PC. This will just take few seconds for applying all the settings. After that, and I'll close out your Windows Ultimate Tweaker. So guys, now the next step, we are going to disable some Windows services on our PCs. Before that, go for your Windows search, search for service, and you will find out the service of your Windows. Open up services. Now you need to press W from your keyboard, and you will find out all the W services of your PC. Now you need to find out here this Windows Error Reporting Service. Simply right-click here, go for Properties, and now go for Startup Type, and simply set it on Disable. After that, hit Apply, click OK. Now you need to scroll down and find out next settings that is your windows update so again open up properties go for startup type and set it on disable then hit apply click ok and guys that's it so guys now on the final and the last step we are going to optimize our system configuration setting so for that press windows r together from your keyboard and type here ms config and press enter now you need to go for this boot tab and there you will find that advanced option settings so go inside it and check mark on number of processor after that click on the drop down and select the highest number available in this list this is the highest available thread of your cpu after that now click ok hit apply click ok Okay, and guys, now you need to one time restore your PC, therefore, all the changes take effect. After that, launch your any favorite game and enjoy the best CPU performance out of your PC. I hope so you love this video. Please make sure to share your opinion about this video in the comment section. And guys, see you again in the next video.